all know what it's like waking up after barely getting any sleep. It sucks and it seems like the day drags on forever. Everyone in this class is either doing a job or going to school in some boat. We have to find time to do the work for this class, our jobs, and our schoolwork, and sometimes that comes with staying up late. It seems like it's a never ending cycle. You come home from school or work just to do a boatload of homework that causes you to stay up until midnight knowing you have to get up earlier the next day. There's been countless of times that I've woken up after barely getting any sleep and it made the day seem like it lasted forever. Not only that, but it messed with my mood, learning, and my health. And after always waking up tired for so long, I wanted to do some research about what can happen to the body when you do not get enough sleep. Today I'm going to be share today I'm going to share with you what happens to your mind and body when you do not get enough sleep. But the main three that I will be focusing on is how sleep affects your mood, learning, and your health. Waking up after a good night's rest, you get a sense of fulfillment, but when you wake up after getting less than eight hours, you can feel what it does to your mood. On April 2017, the Department of Health and Human Services explained that people who are sleep deprived report an increase in anger, sadness, frustration, irritability, and decrease in positive moods. And I for one can say this happens to me. When I am tired, the littlest things irritate me, and I am generally in a bad mood. This not only happens to me, it also happens to my friends the day after not getting enough sleep. They're normally snippy, and the littlest things set them off. Not only does sleep make your mood bad, it can also affect your learning. Not getting enough sleep and going to school is also hard. Getting little sleep also affects your learning, even if you do not realize it. According to Carol Dirkerson, blogger for WebMD, in 2019, researchers believed that the sleep affects that the sleep affects learning and memory in two ways. Lack of sleep impairs a person's ability to focus and learn effectively. Sleep is necessary to make a memory stick so that it can be recalled in the future. We have all been taking a test after staying up late studying, trying to remember something that we swore we knew the day before. Well, since you were up late studying, thinking it was going to help you, it only made that memory not stick. Because you were tired and learning at such a late hour, it also makes it hard to focus, to focus because your brain is in other places. You are thinking about how tired you are or how you're about to fall asleep and how you cannot wait to go to bed. While you're thinking of these things, it makes it hard to intake information and you find yourself going over it again and again. It's crazy to think that sleep can do all this, but it can do more than you think. Not getting enough sleep can also take a toll on your health and in much bigger ways than you think. In 2021, the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention stated that potential problems associated with chronic sleep deprivation are high blood pressure, diabetes, heart attack, heart failure, or stroke. There is evidence according to, according to Centers for Disease Control and Prevention that when you are asleep, your blood pressure goes down. But when you are not sleeping, your blood pressure is staying higher for a longer period. And it is known that high blood pressure is one of the leading risks of heart disease and stroke. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention also stated that diabetes in this, that diabetes is what causes sugar to build up in your blood and getting enough sleep might help people improve their blood sugar. And not getting enough sleep makes it hard to have a constant blood sugar. These are some major health complications that can take over someone's life. And when you think of not getting enough sleep, things like this do not come in mind. Not getting enough sleep causes a lot more than we think it can. It causes negative moods, it can make you not be able to learn as well, and it can have major health complications and get tied back to it. I just think back to all those days that I was crabby or could not remember things for a test, and I look back now and I realize it was because I did not get enough sleep. 